Hey, what's going on, guys? Kumakikins here. You know, like I've been thinking about this new format here on Chess Programming Channel on Chess Engine Overview for quite a bit of time, but I couldn't come up with a proper format so far. But after the recent discussions on Talk Chess, mainly with one of the moderators, Dan Carbit, uh, regarding uh, engine origins and similarities within the source code, and also some hot discussions regarding the efficient lab datable neural networks that are about to be embedded into really lots of uh, strong engines nowadays, uh, I feel that I came up with the proper format uh, to actually make this engine overview or uh, engine overview videos being interesting to the wide range of people hopefully hopefully so you know like uh this video in particular and the engine that i'm supposed to be covering in this video uh, i wasn't really preparing this this wasn't uh, this wasn't uh, this wasn't intended and just to make it as live as possible and just to share my uh, real uh, real reaction uh, i didn't really uh, prepare that much I just had a very uh, a very quick look at the source code, but that has that has gave me an idea of probably some sort of an interesting highlights to talk about regarding the current uh, given engine we're supposed to be uh, having a look at. So I'm really interested to I'm really interested to get your feedback, guys, whether you consider this sort of a new format appropriate and interesting here on Chess Programming Channel. If you want to see more videos of this format. Uh, just please let me know in the commentaries below the video. So this might be an interesting entertainment and well, at the, way, at the same time some sort of an, an educational highlights as well. So uh, it happened absolutely accidentally. So I've been searching for uh, updates regarding Wukong JS testing progress uh, on CCRL. Oh, obviously, it's a little bit too early to talk about that because uh, uh, Sergio Martinez has just started his gauntlet, so it's too early to uh, to look for the results. But surprisingly, uh, this sort of an engine named Wu Tan uh, actually has attracted my attention because uh, fanatically, Wu Tan uh, it's the mountains in China, the birthplace of internal Chinese uh, martial arts, uh, which I'm a big fan of and a practitioner as well for healing purposes, not, not for fighting. But uh, anyway, so this name uh, really attracted me, so I decided to have a look uh, how strong the engine is and what, what's there, what, what's inside, what's going on under the hood, basically. And also, I've been, uh, I've been thinking recently regarding... Uh, looking for some sort of a stronger opponents for for my uh, new updated version of Wukong JS something around nine from 1900s to 20 uh, to 20 hundreds so 1999 uh, 1900s to 2000s basically uh, th those margins of uh, elo rating strength so and I found this this Wutan also perfectly fits uh, to be the next opponent for Wukong JS, despite the fact it's written in C++, still the rating is, the rating is not that big. So I'm really uh, if uh, I'm about to uh, if I will manage to compile and run it, this might be very interesting to yeah to actually try to uh, play around with this. So uh, to, to try to make a match like Wukong JS versus this one because uh, Vice is a little bit. Uh, too strong at the moment. It's where is where is uh, where is vice? It's here 20, 20 hundreds and 44, 20, 44, and this one only 1993. So yeah, that was a nice year. I was a kid. Okay, so yeah, so this is it. And now let's, without further ado, let's actually have a look at the source code and try to get some insights. By the way, an interesting thing, it, it played only 600 games while it was written uh, according to GitHub history around three years ago, so probably I guess that Cicero members has revealed this engine not very long time ago, just very, very not long time, not very long time ago, because, because, because again, like I would definitely see this name uh, because I didn't see this name in the Cicero list before, so probably Sorry guys. So probably this is really uh, getting new, new discovery from from CCRL team. But anyway, let's have a look. So 
Uh, I don't know whether, whether this is a good or bad thing, but well, let's start with a search because it's one of the most essential routines to consider. So uh, when I had a look uh, just at the function names of the search, it, it has instantly reminded me Vice Chess Engine because the name for the name for these functions are absolutely the same are they uh, as they are in Vice, like pick next move, check up, even the read input to uh, asynchronously. Well, maybe asynchronous not not the most correct word. Just just to read the keyboard buffer uh, during engine is calculating to drop from the search uh, on demand, basically. So all these names are very very similar. Quiescence, quiescence yeah. So uh, again, like uh, checking every twenty to the twenty forty seven nodes. So all this constants, check up function, uh, repetition conditions, all this stuff. So all this comes from Vice Chess Engines for those for those of you who's uh, was actually uh, aware of how 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 Vice's search looks like. Oh, it, it, even this stuff regarding <laughs> calculating fail high first and fail high nodes, uh, literally a copy paste from Vice. But uh, I don't really want to blame the guy at any point because uh, one of his, well, I think well, one of the upsides definitely that he's uh, written this in C plus plus. Well, I personally don't really like C plus plus, but this might be beneficial at some point so it's like yeah kind of like a uh, vice written in c plus plus instead of c so it might be a very interesting thing to derive from for someone probably so generate all captures so when i have a look at this search uh well let's we'll start looking for with the alpha beta well so quiescence is is the standard stand pad nothing much yeah so alpha beta search while not in check, well, he has slightly changed. Yeah, he's slightly changed. Well, this is a bit interesting. Oh, this is how he he he, he has added a futility prod into the original code. Well, this is a, a little bit uh, a little bit too many code for for this. Let's say chess programming Wikipedia engine CPV CPW engine has a way better implementation for this just a single array lookup but anyway and and the futility margin calculation as well so quiescence okay is repetition so yeah probe hash entry just like in vice all the same stuff uh, i guess that the format of the hash table is exactly the same in vice as well need to check that out though so make move oh so the norm of pruning okay well generate all moves Okay, so it's using the fail sub framework when the score can go beyond the alpha beta bounds. I don't like that personally. I think that's a little bit of complications, even though considered to be uh, a bit more effective than the fail hard framework that I'm a big fan of. So yeah, then within this, so yeah, here he's sorting the principal variation move. Uh, I can see the hash move sorting though, just like just like I didn't see, or hold on a sec, no, this should be PV move. I don't remember whether it whether it was ordered in in Vice though. Don't really remember at the moment. But anyway, yeah, let's move further on. So uh, on the fly uh, move order in here. So this pick next move should be the same within the questions when it loops over the moves, I guess. Yeah, pick next move, same stuff. So literally first uh, store, uh, first uh, ordering captures in uh, most valuable victim, less valuable uh, uh, attacker order than uh, first and, sell as, and second killer moves, those producing beta cutoffs, and then so-called history moves, producing uh, those that has increased alpha in the previous iteration. So we should see all of this stuff yeah so here so if it's not a capture he stories the first and second killer and here where alpha increases he should be yeah here it's a little bit strange hold on a sec why does he so yeah he well this is a little bit strange the, the reason why people usually incorporate this score greater than equal uh beta within the score greater than alpha is actually to 
store this history move before uh, making a beta cutoff, but here it does this on the country. So this is a little bit questionable. I think if we just put this history, uh, a history right in here before the beta cutoff, it should be working slightly a bit faster. Well, it needs, needs to be tested though, but at the very least it seems a little bit weird place for for this history, for writing the history here in particular. Well, maybe I'm, I've missed something, but anyway, okay, so mate, ch uh, checkmate, stalemate, and again, like good old the, the piece of code that always that 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 you can know for sure from that this is derived from vice because uh, oh, this using this old alpha. Well, actually, it's it's much better to go for well in my in, in my opinion again like it's better to go Bruce Morland's way just to have uh, the hash flag being by default being like. Uh, alpha hash alpha and in case when we hit a better move we just uh, switch the flag to hash exact and then here without any extra conditions we can just uh, write this hash flag th th this this should be a little bit faster because we avoid extra conditioning here and just uh, print whatever so not distinguishing between the exact flag and the alpha flag but uh, we just uh, give a uh, just create another flag and the, the, that would have the value of exact in case if we hit this uh, score greater than best score so uh, where the alpha increases the principal variation move so called and otherwise and otherwise if we don't do this then we drop here uh, where uh, alpha is not uh, where alpha wasn't increased so we just uh, return this uh, we just write this uh, hash flag alpha so yeah, this is exactly like in Vice, so literally copy paste to me, to my eyes. Okay, so search position, just a very basic iterating dipping. Does it does it use uh, aspiration win windows? No, it doesn't. Yeah, so just the, the pure, just the pure rate of dipping. Use I mode, export mode. Yeah, th this this all the same stuff that that we had. Uh, uh, exactly the same stuff that we had in Vice Chess Engine, but uh, let's not. Uh, uh, I don't really want to conclude that this is just a pointless clone, not at all. So uh, anyway, this is a big work to uh, even to port the engine to C++. So it's uh, we, we can see that the guy has been writing this on its own, despite the fact the names and all the functions and the code in general is very very similar. So yeah, let's have a look search is more or less clear so uh, I think this should be going around eight to nine maybe no, no more than ten plies uh, in blitz uh, if if I would uh, if I would manage to compile around this we'll we'll see if that is so okay so let's have a look at the evaluation to see if that has been derived derived from vice as well or not so where is the evaluation function okay evaluation cpp so this must be it okay uh it's interesting to see whether the p square tables are same or not so yeah i just want to have a very quick look yeah by the way uh by the time my new version of Wukong Jazz Plane versus the old version. Yeah, so for now, just, just want to have a look at the P-square tables of Vice to, uh, just to compare to, just to compare them to see whether they are similar or not similar. So, okay, eval, 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 evaluate, this is it, display, Okay, so let's drop to the p square tables. Okay, so uh, okay, so it's white is upside, black is downside. Well, this might be changed, but I need the values. So 30, 30, 20, 20, 10, 10. Okay, so let's have a look. So the values are different. Okay, minus 40. Well, unfortunately, just the blind uh, change of these values with some, somewhat of an uh, somewhat of an idea in mind, other but uh, uh, other but based on testing, 
most likely in most cases just would make the engine plane weaker okay so what about this isolated stuff so probably just use some some sort of his own values okay it seems like just his own values 200 16035 probably that's the reason why it's playing slightly worse compared to vice because because just of the evaluation not being tuned that well if everything this if everything else is the same like the speed of the mode generator and uh, uh, the search optimizations if all the stuff is the same then th this should be the reason of uh, slightly less a plane strength it's just not very well tuned evaluation function 200 100 60 35 20 10 50 yeah so the past bonus is the same again like if you take in some parameters exactly in, in exact way and then if you change in another so it seems like okay semi open file is this three semi open file yeah so it just seems like he, he's taking this parameters uh the same but so but here let's say point table minus 40 minus 40 minus 10 10 8 8 12 12 so and this is already different so you know i guess if you just take exactly the same parameters for evaluation and then uh you just uh try and try to make your own piece score tables most likely this would result in more poor play because uh it's incredibly important to make sure that the values correlate and interact with each other because otherwise uh, just you will just end up with a more uh, poorly tuned evaluation this is very very crucial uh, it's more important that it could see same uh, uh, at a glance okay so let's move further on so p square tables material draw well it seems like uh, he has simplified the material the original material draw function I know that because I've grabbed this material drawing draw entirely entirely from my Wukong JS so it seems like he just simplified the stuff here evaluate position so if material draw returns zero okay so just a pawn just masking pawns okay so he uses the bit boards for Pawn structure at least this is exactly the same like it's done in Vice. Uh, okay, even the names are the same. Okay, so Bish uh, Black Pawn, White Knight. So material plus uh, this uh, p square table. So I can't see where exactly he calculates he counts the material. Uh, so here, this is the game stage, the game phase apparently. By the way, it's uh, in Vice, it's done, kinda, in my personal opinion, too complicated. It can be done much easier. If you have a piece list, you can just... Uh, well, probably this is a little bit faster to keep tra to incrementally update uh, the number of pieces within the mood generator, but it's arguable what's faster, whether to incrementally update this uh, number of pieces or uh, calculate them from scratch every time, because they're, they're really not not really that too many pieces to calculate the games uh the game phase based on based on so it's pretty arguable still okay so it seems like a very similar evaluation like it's done in vice just material 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 plus p square tables plus bond structure and yeah it seems like no can safety just like in vice in the original one yeah so it seems like pretty 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 the same stuff within the evaluation as well okay so let's have a look let's have a look at well, let's have a look at bit boards if anything else but uh for pawns so i think i'm gonna be disappointed yeah so all these masks okay so we just separated the mask Okay, display bit public count bits yeah it's uh i think that only um, that only pawns using bit boards just like in vice while other pieces well uh let's uh where where does the the mood generator well probably we can go to the mood generator i also want to have a look at the e square attack function uh is here attack dot cpp or something uh, Bitboards console data. 
main CPP. I have no idea where it can be. Misc move move gen. Perfed. Well, uh, let's go to move gen in this case. I have no idea where the e square attack function. Yeah, so initializing of MVVLV just like in Vice. Move exist. Yeah, seems like all pretty same. Yeah, this never ending at capture and pawn and then peasant. Yeah, it's all like in style of Vice. Too many code in my uh, in my in my own opinion. A little bit too many of code. Yeah, so loop over all of the piece lists and get in the from square from the piece list, right? Okay. Castlin. Oh my god. Oh man, yeah. All these duplications. Yeah. Yeah, it seems like seems like very ju just exactly like it's done in in the original voice. Nothing nothing new, nothing special. Yeah. Seems like total clone here. Uh, okay, so the very last thing I want to have a look at. Well, it, it would be incredibly interesting to have a look at the e square attack function, to be honest. Uh, because I just. Oh, what, what had just happened? Lokesh58. Who's this guy? Did he write anything else? Just wondering. Uh, Lokesh. Chess engine using neural networks. Chess engine in C. Is he the author? Okay, I'm sorry, guys, just maybe not a little bit to the point, but factorial calculator dev assignment. Seems like the guy is a student. Okay, this one chess engine using neural networks. So it's very promising. Using neural networks in C++, it's a code blocks project. Yeah, it seems like it has been abandoned, I believe. RSFEN. So it seems like a starting template. Okay, it's not. It's out of the scope of this over the, of this review, basically. So let's drop back to Wu Tan. Well, generally, I really like Wu-Tan. Uh, it's lots of work has been done. He's split it even to more files compared to the initial implementation. But okay, where can be board? Yeah, so he has split the header files as well. So where can I have a look at the e square attack function? I'm very, very interested to know that. Mm. Where could it put it in? Into data, data ash h. Uh, yes, yeah, all all derived from voice. All derived from voice, right? Okay, okay. Yeah, so probably the e square attack is just like in the voice. It should be because I can't see any other bit board stuff other than. Uh, points and now uh, within the make move we'll, we'll know this for sure so only point bit boards should be updated nothing much but I just want to have a look so where where the is square attacked maybe in vice this was the board uh, board dot c right something like that the uh, bit, not in bit board it's just been there mm. I can hardly believe this might be in the main. In the misc, not likely. Move CPP. Oh, that is interesting. Position, position, position H. Maybe position CPP. Maybe here. Okay, hold on a sec. Maybe here. Reset board. Update list material, yeah, all from the device. Yes, all all derived from the device. Display clear board. So is square attack. Uh, is is it gonna be here? Yeah, this is it, is square attack. So yeah, absolute absolute copy of of device's implementation. Yeah, 
just absolute copy. Okay, okay. So we'll move CPP. Oh, just parsing the move. Nothing much. Just move move related stuff. Okay. So, well, it seems like it's uh it's a clone of Vice. The only thing that uh, seems different to me. Well, uh, hold on a sec. The make move. No, not the misc. Just the very last file to have a look at is the make move. Uh, make move. This is it. So this is the very last file to have a look. Canceling permissions. Did you at least? Yeah. Okay. Thank God. Okay. So uh, uh, I was just checking for canceling bits. Okay. So. There are so many clones of voice out there, so I just want to have a look at. Uh, yeah, this is it. Make move. Okay, so handling the, the, the specific cases, castling. Yeah, the the move stack is implemented exactly the same way. The order of actions within the make move function is still the same. Yes, yeah, all. Just, guys, just, just to give you an idea, of what am I talking about? I'll just let me just open, let me just open uh, the make move from original Vice. Okay, where is that? Here it is. Display. So just just to give you an idea, what do I mean here? So let's go for line by line comparison. So from square to square side. We drop this he even has the same assertion so from square to square uh didn't define the site well uh all of this move piece yeah clear piece so all the same we have here you see like move piece clear piece handle the flag so if uh bitwise end in the move with an impasant flag and otherwise Else with a uh, ca with a castling flag, so same here, in peasant castling. Uh, storing the hash the hash key or position key before this. So you see, like literally line by line here, goes line by line. Yeah, if position is not even uh, is not equal to no squares, the, the, then a hash in the in peasant. Well, he just he just does this. Uh, he, he just doesn't use the macros, so uh, uh, Richard Albert used the macros like hash and pass and hash castling, but this guy just went th went straight ahead for uh, xorin. But that's the same. That's exactly the same way I do. I, pr I personally really like this approach. It seems to be more more explicit one. Then yeah, updating the move stack. Oh, the history reply. This call history reply here. Updating castling permissions. Ca hash and castling before and after so yeah so uh, hash and castling before and after yeah all the same after captured incrementing this this yeah 50 rule move well uh, obviously uh, the things to consider within the make move functions are the same for all that for all the engines but the order of operations and the implementation might be different if you just have a look at uh, Wukong.js implementation you'll see that it's it's different it's they all similar but it's a little bit different okay so yeah and for pawns for pawns also uh so there should be some bitboard related stuff just can't see where is the bitboard related stuff uh, okay it's not not yet that oh probably Probably that just relies with the, within the move piece, clear piece, and add piece here. Yeah, this is it. Yeah, clear in bits. Yeah, yeah, this is it. So clear piece, and also a clear in bits from uh, the pawn bit board. Okay, add in piece or set in bits. And when we move moving the piece, we're moving the piece, we just clear in bits and set in bits on the, uh, if not piece big, yeah, so it's literally if this is not. Uh, pawn, uh, if this is not knight skins, uh, rogues, bishops, queens, just the pawns in this case, we're making this uh, incremental updates on pawn bit boards. So, yeah, this is it. Uh, seems to be like almost 100% clone of Vice Chess Engine. The only thing that seemed to me a bit different so far is the 
p square tables uh i'm not sure regarding the material weights uh maybe he has changed them as well but again like the matter of why this is not that strong as vice is probably just because just because of this rating drop down compared to this this one most likely should occur because of uh, uh, slightly more poor uh, poorly tuned or non-tuned at all uh, big square tables okay guys so let's try to compile and run it to make sure to see if at the very least it kind of works and i think this would be a very good candidate to uh, play a hundred match match a hundred games match uh, against for Wukun JS. So this might be very interesting. So I just want to get copy the link for git cloning. Okay, so I don't want to this here and just open the terminal and git clone. I really hope it has. Oh, I'm sorry. I really hope it has uh, some sort of a built-in make file because I don't really want to. Uh, I don't really want to. Uh, oh man, wait. Uh, to create that on my own so any make file I can't see the make file where is the make file are you kidding me man no don't tell me don't tell me there is no make file please uh, no. <laughs> okay so uh yeah in that case let's try to go step by step so if i just try to arrange items by oh no it's just i want to view them as a list like this uh, i'm not sure whether the order matters it shouldn't be okay yeah, this would be a little bit of a challenge. I, I don't promise that this is going to work. So it seems like uh, we need to use the G++. I really hope that the standard G++ would work. Uh, I think we can use some optimization flags as well. Oh, let's try for is this main CPP. It's very it would give tones of errors now, but I just want to make sure that, yeah okay 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 so let's now go step by step so bit boards bit boards dot cpp again i guess i don't promise that this is going to work because i never tried this before never tried to compile this engine in particular before so console dot cpp data dot cpp oh my god man why to create so many files for such a simple engine okay data dot cpp evaluation evaluation dot cpp yeah probably he was compiling and clicking code blocks yeah that's the reason why he, he why yeah no make file there so it was using some sort of an id apparently okay evaluation hash key hash key dot cpp init dot cpp main cpp is already there okay make move cpp uh misc cpp is this no it's not the end yet misc then move dot cpp then move gen dot cpp okay perfect cpp guys it's so so weird not providing the make file always provide a make file to avoid this weird 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 thing that i'm d doing now okay perfect cpp polybook cpp it's not necessarily needed but might be included as well poly keys cpp position dot cpp 
Yeah, I, I was at very least rename, renaming all the variables, not only the source file files, but I was initially cloning Vice when I was learning to code, not only chess pro programming, but to code as well in general. Okay, PV table. He only uh, rename the source file and make more of those. Okay, PV table position search UCI search UCI uh, validate CPP export okay let's have a look is this if this is gonna compile uh, are you kidding me man he did this on Windows <laughs> Oh man, no. Oh, I hate Windows. I hate it so much. Okay, so can we do something for it? Corneo.h. Use this for console, apparently. Okay, so uh, I think this comes from here. Uh, nope. Okay, then which file in particular? Just try. Uh, uh, I just want to try to disable. Uh, okay, make move and misc. Why the heck to use this corneo in make move? You kidding? Oh, how I hate Windows! If you only know that, guys. If you could only imagine. Um, how did he use that? I can't ever imagine how did he use that conio.h and why. And well, let's try again to see how we deal with this error. Obviously, I don't have this headers. I'm not on Windows. Okay, seems like we just passed silently. Okay, misc cpp. Uh, ah, probably that is used for yeah. I think that is used for get uh, get time in milliseconds, but that can be easily uh, resolved. So yeah, here misc. Yeah, so get time milliseconds, and here I just quickly grab. Well, I can grab the implementation from original Vice, by the, by the way. It's probably would be the best ever thing to consider. So let's open the new tab and go into... Well, uh, when you're working with a clone of Vice, it's incredibly easy to reuse the pieces of code. And if you're cloning the Vice, you can at very least make a cross-platform like the original is. Because otherwise, it, it's so weird. Okay, didactic engines, Vice and misc here display this is how this goddamn should be done okay just can you just copy paste this very simple uh not sure it should should work actually really hope this should work okay let's try again Mm. Hold on a sec. IO dot H. Hmm. Well, this is a little bit strange to say at least. Uh, I'm using G plus plus so. Don't tell me he don't tell me he used Microsoft compiler, please. Don't make me angry, please. Okay, so maybe use this for read input. Uh, what can be worse than a clone of an engine for Windows, man? Oh no. Okay, so this all comes from I think. Okay, hold on a second. Function input wait in. Hold on a sec. This should be 
Yeah, I just I can just hold on a sec. Why not to make it just like this? Okay. Paste and just to make sure hundred percent sure that everything works, I just want to clone the read input as well. I'm not sure what or well, probably read input is exactly the same here. Okay. I try to make a normal make file. Oh man. Oh. Red input declared void. Okay. Hold on a sec. Oh, it wasn't. Okay, hold on. Okay. I'm losing a hope to compile this piece of code. Really? Okay. In function can so loop. Man, are you kidding me? In function can so loop multiple definitions of can so loop. Well, at very least, more undefined references to get time ms follow. Get time. Should be like this. Right. So at least trying to, try to resolve this get time ms for a while. I'm a bit concerned with this. What's wrong with the console loop? Okay. Okay, so uh, hold on a sec. Oh, it's called get time ms like this, man. You kidding me, really? Oh, okay. Let's grab only the content. Okay. And also, so input, input waiting, input waiting this part okay okay why people use Windows I can't understand this why people use Windows this is so weird Come on, I didn't change the name now. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, I need to get back to this. I just forgot to restore the haters back to make sure that this get time and mess and input waiting working properly. Okay. Yeah, he could have at least copy paste things properly. Okay, so UCI CPP validate CPP export CPP multiple definition of engine options first defined here. In function console loop multiple console loop. Where the heck is that console loop? 
Okay. I can only be guessing. Console loop. So, well, let's try try lock at main CPP. Console loop. Loop. Can I just get rid of that console loop? I just want the UCI, nothing much. Okay, so initialize all, initialize hash table. Okay, okay. Well, okay, okay. If input would and yeah, just I just don't really want this. Uh, I don't want this X board as well. So I just, yeah, I just want to get rid of this entire part. Give me the UCI and nothing much. Just give me the UCI, please. Okay. Yeah, this works. Oh, no, this doesn't. Okay. In function console loop. Where is that goddamn function console loop? Uh in IO should be in IO is there any IO console CPP probably it's here console loop okay can you just please okay can can I hold on a sec can I can I get rid of this entirely or maybe, uh, well, maybe I just, uh, maybe I just could not include the console CPP into the compilation. Yeah, so if I, if I would ever uh, succeed in compiling this engine, then probably I'll just make a make file so you guys could avoid suffering with this sort of stuff. Okay, now the only thing left here is multiple definition of engine options where the heck do i find this engine options it doesn't even call oh. engine options main cpp maybe in the uci loop Okay, let's try uh, UCI. Okay, engine options, engine options. Okay. Okay, can I, uh, where did it come from? UCI H. So I just want to I just want to command out everything that doesn't work. Uh, UCI H maybe there. UCI H. Engine options. Nope. Then data dot no maybe misc dot H. Or data dot H. Let's try both. Not here. So maybe data dot h. External options, engine options. Yeah, let's switch this entirely. Off. In function main. Okay, let's. Drop back to main. Okay, so engine options here. So just want to find all the engine options available. Oh, if you know, guys, how I hate this over unnecessary over complications. Twenty I main CPP twenty six. Man, are you kidding me? Oh, 
Oh, it just didn't save. Well, as far as I've commanded out the export, probably don't need that. Okay, now it's something wrong with this init polybook. Okay, so I don't want export. I don't want polybook and polycase case. Give me just the bare minimum USA version and that's it. Can you do this? Okay, in search position, engine options. Okay, okay, let's go to the search position. Where is the search position? Okay, can you do it now? I don't want any opening books. GUI serving that purpose. Why do you use opening book within the chess engine when you can do that within the GUI? In function init all polybook. Okay, so it feels like we're pretty close. Uh, init all init init polybook. I don't want that. Are you gonna work one day? Okay, in function main clean polybook. Main clean polybook. Anything else? Another undefined reference to engine options. Let's try not not include this one. Let's try not include this one. Where do I define this engine options? I have no idea. You must be kidding. Okay, do we have engine options? In the search? Nope. in the position doesn't seem so in it so look at the in it dot h Man, okay. Okay, just too many, too many files being open. Okay, so where can I have this damn multiple definition? Doesn't even so. Doesn't even tell me which file in particular. Maybe if I just try simply to hold on a sec. 
to just compile maybe in that case it will tell me what kind of file would be result in this error instead of this temp.o slash temp slash some line name oh so it, it even it even does compile so this is the linker error not the compiler error well this is interesting so it's the linker error not the compiler so they get compiled they all are getting compiled well I can assume that the order might be might matter here but well uh generally shouldn't happen first define the year oh my god engine options Okay, let's search code mackey's way every single damn file engine options oh guys i'm sorry i didn't even realize when in particular i've paused the video recording i'm so sorry about this oh my god did you see this well i have no idea wh wh when did i stop actually this recording oh well anyway after lots of swearing, I finally managed to compile this Wutan by disabling some unnecessary feature features, making the get time milliseconds cross platform. So now it runs on my Linux as well. A couple more things. Uh, I would also need just to create a make file so it would be compiled normally on, uh, instead of making this via code blocks or wherever IDE he used for, for this. And now. Uh, yeah, I have my video recording software loading, so also, my, did my tournament finish? Hold on a sec. Yeah, it has finished. Oh, this is good. So, wow, the result is quite pretty nice. It's almost 200 L points at the very end. This is very good result, I'm sorry guys. So, yeah, I don't need Arena. I just want to measure... Uh, the plane strength so let's say go move time and one second so see what depth it goes to whoa depth 13 well this is impressive this is impressive depth 13 <laughs> Well, it's compiled with the optimizations. Well, hold on a sec. I just want to compare this with Obias because uh, it seems a little bit too fast for a clone unless it actually changed something there. I was expecting depth the depth 10 at very most. Hold on a sec. So, didactic engines, vice. Uh, well, let's run uh, a compilation by maybe this one by Richard himself. So yeah, instead of uh, I just have the Linux version been slightly altered at the moment, so I won't be. I, I just don't really want to compile that uh, version of Vice, even though that's possible. So I just want to try my Vine simulator and uh, my Vine uh, Windows emulator here to run this Vice. 1064 bit version I guess dot executable UCI okay okay we're up we're up there so go move time one thousandths you kidding me man no <laughs> okay forget this let's go for recompiling stuff so i just want to make well actually hold on a sec mm, it, it would just run the perf test at, uh, uh, at the beginning but uh yeah it's a bit too long so let's disable it better i, I, I was just comparing the perf results so main 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 or no no vice vice dot c display mm. Yeah, now it should be working as a normal engine. So, 
want to make and if it makes to run vice okay uci position start pass good and go move time one second Oh, I just, hold on a sec. No, 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 I just, wait, sorry. I just, uh, wrong, wrong spelled. Okay, again, UCI, uh, position, start, pass. Just a typo, go move time. And one thousand. <laughs> Only depth seven. And this guy goes depth 13. Hmm. Okay, did I did I make uh did I run it this uh with this with all the optimizations possible? Let's have a look display. Oh I just didn't. Okay. So let's make it yeah, it's it's not to be compared, so yes. Optimizations mean really lots, mean really lots, so let's try again now, should be much better. Okay, UCI, position, start, pause, and go move time. One second. Well, not significantly, so only depth 8 and here nope and here we have depth 13 well depth 13 is way more impressive much more impressive but so there should be some difference in the search I I'm very confused now guys and uh, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm even more confused because um, well the PV should be definitely different uh, I'm confused even more because it's actually weaker how the engine that plays depth 13 may be weaker compared to oh well it uses the futility prodding I remember right so well we could have run a couple of games quit quit this might be a good test especially bearing in mind that hold on a sec did i just save oh no did i did i forget to save opening terminal i just want to save this into a make file copy and make fall so all uh, uh, just want to make sure it makes make and if it makes run Wu Tan. Yeah, at least guys now you hopefully would it be it would be much easier to compile this. Uh go move time one second. Well, this is impressive, so, but this, despite the much deeper search, it's still, uh, it still plays weaker compared to Vice, believe it or not. So, well, uh, I don't know, so just, just want to have a look at the search one more time, because it's really kind of like interesting. So I'm sorry for the environmental sound. My one of my cats is now eating. Okay. K 
can't do anything for that to that. Okay. So the move ordering clear for search seems all the same. Maybe quiescence is faster. No, it's not. It's all the same. It's all the same. So well, okay, futility prying, but futility prying can't really I don't believe this futility futility prying will give such a big so maybe he's, he's, he's using okay so now move prying okay does he use late move reduction does he use principal variation search what he uses oh 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 whoa 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 okay 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 so okay late move reduction now now makes perfect sense well uh, it's pretty arguable regarding this implementation in particular. Does he research? He doesn't seem to be making. Well, I don't really want to judge this code too much, but even my noobs implementation of uh late more reduction seems a little bit more complicated so the problem is that uh it just does this well okay so let's better let's just better see how how it plays rather than thinking and guessing so yeah the uh the reason behind why 13 plies within one, one second instead of 8 plies is because the futility prania and this late move reduction. That's a very simple reason. But I truly believe that the way it's done here is not the most accurate thing. So, okay, so if move number is greater... Oh, man. Okay, so the first, if move number is greater than 1, it should be at least 4. Because otherwise you, you might reduce the depth for moves that are potentially very good. So yeah, uh, despite the, the fact that it's going much deeper, it just might violate the search. So the engine might be playing even stronger without this. So you just 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 if getting rid of this cow block and just leave the, the bear uh, sort of a thing here. It might be, it might already be playing around 20, 30 uh, uh, points stronger because uh, no one does late move reduction. Uh, for all of the moves, that's that's weird nonsense. At least four moves should be done. Well, if not in check, this is correct. Uh, if this is not a uh, flag, if uh, not doing this for captures, this is correct. Uh, not doing this for promotions, well, this is correct as well. Okay, just just want to very uh, very, uh, very very quickly show you. Uh, late move reduction implementation in Wukong just to give you an idea of uh, some tiny little nuances during this stuff. So we have a look. Control F, LMR. So first of all, we, we need to make sure that not that we are not within the principal variation. No, this is absolutely essential. So the move search, at least three move search. So starting from the move number four, not from the move number two as we have here. So that's the first thing to consider. If the depth is greater than at very least two, this is also important. So no depth check in here. So it seems like the guy has just tried to obtain a deeper depth without uh, being bothered by does it actually improve the plane strength or not? So that's the typical beginner's mistake I went through, uh, I, I've been through as well. In check is fine. Uh, well, also some additional uh, uh, checkup for uh, killer moves, uh, which I took from chess program on Wikipedia. I'm not sure how likely that would be. Well, capture and promote are just exactly the same. The formula I'm using depth minus two, he's using a bit more aggressive depth minus three, which is generally fine yeah so okay guys just hold on a sec <coughs> sorry okay so a bit just a bit too aggressive prying well this is possible this is okay okay and 
so it doesn't restore the score for alpha. Yeah, and also it just it just doesn't do. It just doesn't do principal variation search, and instead it just do, does the normal search, which is which is okay. So yeah, at the very least, you should have checked for principal variation node. So yeah, uh, a very very noobs implementation. I know that because I was doing some, something very similar uh, in my previous attempts. Okay, so let's have just let's have a look at just a couple of games maybe between these two engines to. Just it's, it's interesting to see how it goes. So let's try to install them into Arena. I need to update the path to Vice because I've replaced that. So let's very quickly walk through that. So uh, Vice should be here, but I need to update. So where is this? Nope. Home. Uh, desktop CMK. Okay. Vice. This one. Open. Apply. And disable book. I just want to engines play without opening books. And let's ins install the new one. The, the new one. So. Oh, it's not yet in, within the didactic engine, so let's go to desktop and O10. Okay, UCI. Uh, don't remember the name of the author. Lokesh, if I'm mistaken. Is that? Lokesh, right. Okay, so engines manage O10, Lokesh. Blockage O10 apply no opening books and I'm gonna be doing going for the tournament to not to uh, violate the results of my of what I've played so far with my own version so let's just try to load them as the as the just the engine so vice would be the engine one O10 would be engine two apply and levels Two minutes, one second increment, pretty standard stuff. So let's give him a try. So go for a self play, please. So yeah, the standard uh, hash table size seems to be the same. Uh, okay, so so Wu Tan has seems to be. Well, not. No. I thought it th thought it just would be a bit bigger kilonodes per second value. Fourteen kilonodes. So you want to say this is faster? No, it's about equal. Seems like exactly the same mode generator. Okay. Okay. So now the depth. So Wutan is playing white. Okay, depth 14. Well, depth looks like pretty impressive, but you've seen this CCRL rating, okay? So you've seen this only 1993. So despite the fact it goes really deep, it doesn't really mean much. So I'm really tempted to see how the game ends. So Wu Tan has all the chances. Well, obviously, one game doesn't mean anything, really. So I'll try to evaluate. I don't know how to call it, uh, the accuracy of moves, maybe the quality of the game entirely. So, well, again, like, it has, uh, Wu-Tan has all the chances, but I really like uh, Black's position. So Black thinks he's a little bit better, and, and White thinks he's much better. It's more than pulling up. But I really like how the black position looks here because all the wh all the white pieces seems to be silly and blocked while black now would start infiltrating on the queen side and I really feel this should end up with a hack attack and this with this late mo with this fake depth uh, being uh, be, uh, being done by 
uh, not most clever uh, implementation of late mode reduction this shouldn't be this shouldn't go that far really so yeah so he said like no bugs has been found well uh, probably no bugs in terms of like I don't know maybe it's not crashing but it's not crashing because it's literally a vice that's that's the reason why it doesn't crash and regarding the how place this is definitely a bug to implement the late mode reduction in that way so well still it's interesting to see okay so the bishop is infiltrating already so okay rook to f8 trying to checkmate well it's not a checkmate yet but so rook takes no pawn takes well this is interesting well this double pawn's not very that great but I, I really I really believe that vice should win this so what about the material so vice still thinks he's better despite this pawns it's hard to say whether these double pawns are, are are bad or not they are actually in the center and they might be a very uh, a horrific weapon eventually yeah oh, a very nice place for knight on c4 so this pawn is not going anywhere which is also a good idea so okay well this queen is literally going to nowhere why just don't have space to move their places so uh, i really need to say that from the evaluation perspective vice seems much more solid here yeah obviously it doesn't hit that that great depth but yeah seems quite pretty solid but it would be interesting to play versus Wu Ten with this late mode reduction bug like implementation this Wukun JS would have lots of chances uh, in the uh, versus Wu Ten so this might be a very interesting a very interesting game to consider now, now the Queen now what Queen is totally locked so I think Queen H3, yeah, Queen H3. So what else? It's gonna, uh, yeah, just okay. So pawn takes, no rook takes. Whoa, this is very very interesting. Okay, so grabbing the pawn. Well, bishop should be stronger than the knight in the end game. So why should exchange this bishop? I think. Well. okay so black just simply collecting the pawns at the moment oh he's gonna be pushing this pawn he's gonna be pushing the h pawn i believe okay yeah now just the h5 okay now this is getting very very interesting so king safety of white king is a big question here a very very big question would it be nice to redirect the rooks somewhere to g6 eventually okay just crushing the pawns oh man he's just crushing all of the pawns so now mating one is threatening okay why well, doesn't seem to care about that so taking the taking the rook it doesn't even take the rook hold on a sec it doesn't okay no it does fortunately no more in peasant square is available but oh just losing a piece here okay now just yeah that's so you see like despite the deeper depth this is go depth 17 but it's just blundering pieces that's the downside of this bug implementation of late mode reduction guys that's what I, that's what i wanted to tell you so what was the reason to search that that dip if you're just blundering the pieces and searching worth eventually it doesn't make any sense now, now it just gives up a queen you see yeah just to avoid a check being checkmated so yeah white is totally doomed this is the total domination by black pieces such a such a great game you just can't even exchange this it's totally winning already it's totally winning now yeah just exchange stakes stakes and then oh it goes for a check yeah now it just takes the rook nope just oh man now he takes the rook okay yeah it's total crush total crush so yeah wu -Tan is not the best clone of Vice, but it would be really interesting to beat it 
with Wukong. Yeah, that would be very interesting. Yeah, this is me. Oh my god, <laughs> I, I, I was asleep. This is me. Well, okay, guys, so I think this is it from my side. I hope you've enjoyed the video. So let me know in the commentaries below the video how likely it. Uh, how, how good the, the how good the idea to overview the chess engines uh, like you've seen here uh, yeah so this is it basically this is kind of it so yeah I'm really I'm really tempted to know whether you like this new format or not so please let me know this is it from my side hope you enjoyed the video learned something interest interesting out of it uh, take care of your late move reduction take it seriously it's not only the matter of getting uh, of searching deeper you need to search correct moves and try not to blunder things so depth is not all yet because if you're searching deeper but reducing uh the depth for essential moves you're ending up like wood handed versus uh, versus vice so you should have avoid this and yeah i think this is quite pretty instructive here okay guys so this is it from my side. Kobe Monkey King was with you. And until the next time, and take care.